Good day. Today I want to present our paper uh, using topic modeling uh, for automation search to reviewer. Nowadays, the practice shows rapid growth in the number of academical products. There are academical articles, conference proceedings, books, reports, presentations, etc. Evaluating such a large number of scientific documents is a complex multi-phase task. Maintaining the uh, scientific research quality and uh, publication is a uh, prerequisite for ensuring the science development. Uh, popularization of ethics and research integrity, ensuring transparency of the uh, peer review process and use of intellectual text processing methods. To determine the article quality at the stage of scientific peer review and ensure the objectivity of the peer review process. First, ensuring the transparency of the scientific review process by creating instructions and tools. And the second, selectively uh, in choosing the review. Uh, in our paper, we describe the approach for the second point, selectivity in choosing the review. We tried to find all exist software for this problem and one of the popular is Springer's Review Finder. In this tool, offers to select an expert based on the metadata of publications. The correspondence algorithm returns a list of researchers who have a publishing profile similar to the profile of the manuscript after. But sometimes the information from the profile is not enough for a qualitative analysis. In our paper we can read about uh, other similar tools. On this slide you can see the information about our data. For automated processing and formation of our information topic model, from Scopus we export information more than 2,000 publications from the computer science domain. This is journal articles and uh, publications from uh, 2020 and 20 to 2021, and we took authors from Ukraine. Statistics of publications are presented on this slide. It should be noted uh, that articles <coughs> may be uh, interdisciplinary. It means that the uh, same paper at the same time relates um, to two areas. Uh, one field is computer science and the other field is determined by the scope. Uh, this is uh, evidenced by a 24 subject area, which includes uh, <coughs> 2,550 publications in computer science and the top 10 subject area is presented in this table. Uh, this is engineer, mathematics, energy, social science, chemistry, etc. Uh, Scopus provides export of five metadata groups of publications in CESWEF text format intended for presentation of table data, citation information, bibliographical information, abstract and keywords, funding details and other information. Uh, for our model we used uh, six types of metadata uh, which in identify the author or authors of the publication and reflect the thematical areas of the article. Uh, this is authors, authors ID, title, abstract, abstract keywords and index, uh, index keywords. On the slide, you can see the general information about this metadata, such as uh, uh, total number of tokens, uh, tokens with the length of four and more, uh, the average length of metadata field, number of original tokens, and the percentage of original tokens to that total number. The general approach for review funding in, uh, is presented on this slide. Uh, first of all, we need to define the source of uh, publications, um, data, uh, it may be a scopus or web of science or local uh, database. After this, we extract text array of publication metadata and uh, uh, need to um, 
pre-processing for this data and put this information to the topic model and algorithm. After this, we um, put this information uh, to the uh, use this um, model in our informational topic model and uh, receive information uh, from our article. Uh, and uh, after uh, some stages, we receive the final list of potential reviewers. Data from the Scopus database, namely uh, metadata from the computer science articles, uh, were used as experimental data. Uh, and um, our articles <coughs> were taken in 2021 and 2022. Fields such as title, abstract, after keywords, index keywords were used as a basic data. Uh, there is enough data to use a LDA method as a basic topic model algorithm. Uh, all data uh, based uh, the pre-processing stage, uh, namely the remove of stop words, remove of uh, punctuation numbers, etc. And morphological analysis was also used uh, to use only parts of speech such as nouns, verbs, and adjectives. As a result of experiments with the value of coherence, it was found that the best uh, division in, into topics is uh, for 34 classes. The form informational topic model contains uh, 34 topics according to the statistical of publication data. Uh, publication are divided into 24 subject, uh, subject areas. Those the elder distribution forms a large number of classes by 10 topics and it's more detailed. For experiments on the review selection, we took articles from the journal Kubernetes and System Analysis. As a result of the experiments with topic models, the following results were obtained. You can see these results on this slide. Uh, the following slide contains the visualization of topic model stage. You can see that more bubbles are concentrated in one place. It's related with the domain computer science. As this slide is presented as a list of reviewers for each uh, article and this results of our work and our model. The process of finding reviewers for a journal article or conference is always a rather complicated process. It's not always possible to understand by the scientific interests of the reviewers by keywords uh, where we will able to uh, qualitatively review the paper with the area of his scientific interests. Uh, the approach we proposed using the methods of topic model and natural language processing uh, allows us to obtain not only the research topics but also take into account possible conflicts of interest between authors, uh, thanks um, to information from metadata. Uh, the topic modeling was built on the basis of Scopus data and tested on the journal articles. Uh, the results show that our approach works uh, quickly and efficiently. The authors proposed by our method are relevant and, uh, to the research topic. In addition, uh, reference metadata that reflects the content of the article includes references. Uh, however, references uh, can contain both positive and negative links. This metadata also contains many words that cause the white nose. Uh, the use of references metadata needs uh, uh, further analysis and it's planned for future research. In the future, we plan to test and evaluate the performance of our method for a real journal with existing uh, data on reviewers. Thank you for your attention.